Hello, this is Lucrative Gaming. I got a new toy. It looks pretty cool. And this is called the Accu Trooper, aka the Alpha Trooper, as everyone else calls. No, he's played Nerf for more than ten. I gotta minutes. ask you, why do they call it the Alpha Trooper? Because that's the old name, the okay. original name. So this is the new body. What's different between this and the Alpha? It has a nozzle. It's been chip prime because someone thought that was a good idea. Please okay, comment why you think that's a good idea because it's a horrible we idea. We didn't get it ship prime. We got it at Walmart, which maybe they unprimed them, but it didn't seem well, to be some primed did. there. Yeah, some of them were primed, some of them weren't. We don't know if they yeah. unprimed them or primed them, but we got it's got pretty much what most people think is the best stock ever. A massive drum. By the way, by nozzle, do you mean the piece that the... Yeah, barrel okay. attachment. Barrel attachment, okay. And yeah, it's, it's got, got a snazzy drum. paint job. Yeah, the drum is the part that really kind of threw me off, because, you know, I oh, wasn't expecting that. Uh, this oh, it comes not with Accu Strike bullets. Yeah. Because, why not double the price and put Accu Strike darts? Um, and a drum. <laughs> yeah, I'm not <laughs> That's sure. pretty much their whole new thing. Why the, the Accu Strike darts cost so much? I would like to, however, at this point, refer back to his dart review because so, the little green ones, the purple tips are awesome. Or blue, sorry. Yeah, I'm going to snip everything out real quick, so see you in a moment. Hello, we magically unpacked it. And yeah, the magic is there. <laughs> this one was... that this one? I don't know. Harder to get out. A little harder to, yeah, it was a little harder to get out than other ones that we've purchased in the past. Then we have the darts. Okay, well, as noted, he has it all assembled, which is pretty cool. What do you think of it? Okay. May I see it? Because I haven't actually had a chance to hold this. I like the balance and the fact that the balance, it kind of feels like you need to be holding on to this part. And you said uh, it's a slam fire? Yep. So I'll hold the trigger, ka chunk ka chunk ka chunk ka chunk ka chunk and it works. Oh. If you have darts, okay. Um, At least it's to to cock it to get rid of the drum? Yep, like always. Like always? Okay, so that's still there. We'll try loading a drum a bit. Okay. Not completely. I'm not going to make you so sit let's see what that. this looks like. Okay, so this is bare bones. Yep. I hey, kind of like it, though I can't it. see it. Huh? Don't destroy my spring like Walmart. Deprime. It's not prime. Oh. Or I need to prime it the rest of the way, but I don't think it's going to prime without the clip on. Oh. That makes no sense, though. How was it primed on the other ones? Aha. Okay, well, it's going to, I'm a little slow on the learning curve with these things for some times. Well, it is an, in a bigger platform. Hmm. Well, this is interesting. There we go. Yeah, it's pretty much just like a loading a magazine, which is good. I'm not sure if you can see this, but there's like this strange little imperfection in colors on the, the handle. Hmm. I'm not turning it back over or something like that, but you know. Oh, uh, there's also dart now. storage in the bottom. Dart storage? Yep. Seriously? They, they mean that? Yep. So you got a drum of 25 and they want you to keep one dart in the handle? Yep. Well, think about, like, HBZ, though. In case I surrender, but really don't mean it. <laughs> Every dart counts, man. I wouldn't buy a jolt if that wasn't the case. Okay. What about the Loot Llama jolt that they're coming out with? Well, yeah, but that's just good. I wouldn't buy a Bare Bones jolt if that wasn't the case. Okay. Or you could do the Blackbeard thing, which is keep about five jolts hanging off you. One of our new friends does that, don't they? I think so. Yeah. Do you still have the dart in the handle? Or did I take that out? You took that out. Okay, good. I can't get over this. There's a dart handle thing. I think that that might be on the retaliator. Really? Yeah. We have that, don't we? Yes. How come I never noticed that? I It might be. I didn't want to put it in there because I don't want to get stuck. But okay. I filled up the drum while we were talking. Take a look. Okay, so it all feeds in through the top. It's just like a regular magazine. Show. So it's a regular magazine in that regard. Oh, that feels good. Um, a real stock. 
It's a spring driven design, correct? Yes. And this part here, what's this for? Push for adjuster. I a dart sure. reset. Okay. That's good. So I get that. Okay, let's pause and do a firing demo. All right, cool. Hello, I got my Alfie Trooper here. And okay. we're going to shoot it. Shoot. We are going to take it up. Uh, once you get back to firing position. Uh, yes, I know. There's a frog. Frog. Uh, camera. But well, it's a cool here. frog. So enjoy. Okay. It's the frog father in our, our house. Nice. Third one gets the blob. Now that was the slam fire. And with this gun in particular, you really have to get it to uh, the very end of the firing sequence. And it yeah. seems a little Like sometimes long. you have to, like, you really have to go at it. Yeah, I don't know. It, it, the or you could go lefty style, which would give you probably stronger. But it'll screw your aim up. It'll mess up your Unless aim. you're a lefty, but then they'll screw your strength up. So, I don't know. It's really a trade-off, yeah. Like it's up. Head changing. I'll tell you what, though. In a Nerf War, this thing would be awesome. Would you like to try? Uh, as left, much as I might, might. Let's see if there's anything left in here. Let's see if I can do something. Yes. Yeah, there's a couple left. Like two. <laughs> well, that's enough. Two is a shot, and shot is a shot. And also, there's a barrel, which is... It's a little awkward trying to aim with the slam firing it. Yeah. But it's still a really cool gun. If you got 40 bucks, I think it's worth getting. Yeah. Let's show you some of the other stuff with it real quick, though. You want to put a pause on this? Yes. Okay. Okay, it's for whoever cared about, about the firing demo. You can leave now. It's time yeah. for nerdy talking. Okay. <laughs> now... So, a few things to note. A few, I found one attachment that didn't fit. And it was the tri-strike thing, like tri-strike front gun. Do you want me to get that out? Uh, don't yeah. worry about it. Sure? It's the thing that shoots mega darts off the tri-strike. Yeah, I thought it was a really cool piece, and it was a little disappointing it didn't yeah. fit. Um, the other uh, barrel attachment didn't fit terribly well. Yeah. Did you put that away, too? Uh, that one it was just because it was too large, though. Huh? That one was just because it was too large. That little extra nose piece? Like that? The silencer-looking one? That one fit fine. Oh, well, why did I get that? Uh, this Sorry. one, this scope fits beautifully on this gun. And it definitely screams out, this is something you could, uh, modify and have it look like something. Yeah, this didn't, uh, there's, this is... And very nice, but I personally, the only reason I do that is if I have a scope in it, I don't really feel it that much. Yeah, like for the painters, something like this would be pretty cool because it gets you that bottom rail. Here. But there's one funny thing about the bottom rail is uh, if you're using the drum attachment, the bipod and probably the tripod, if attached to it, aren't going to work. Oh, that so. there's no locking mechanism. Yeah, that I was it's a little, little awkward. About. But I mean, it looks great with a lot of these different ones. You want to show like, that one off too? Barrel drag. <laughs> right. Yeah. I like how this one. This and, actually looks pretty good, though. Yeah, the rest of the series is really put together and colored the same. Yeah. Here, why don't you put the? Um, I missed the blue. AK on it. But the. Uh... Oh, that looks good. And it really, there it really go. takes the full AK modulus mode. selection. I'll have to print out, try finding one of those 3D printed AK kits. Cause those so there were a couple other things we were okay. toying with as ideas here. So uh, I like know, this. Obviously, my barrels look a lot. Great. You want to try a couple of the different stocks? <sighs> yeah, stock is beautiful, but you know, sometimes you need to get short corners. Now I know I'm all cramped up, but. I don't really mind it that much. Uh, about the Personally. reason why I like a short stock is if I'm one arm and a gun. Like, that kind of yeah. keeps me a little less Although bouncy. I do kind of... I like getting all up on a gun. Mm. 
but in truth, this stock is already this gun, and it yeah. really looks like the Retaliator but, stock. Here, take this. If we please. only had the Retaliator yeah. in orange. You wait. <laughs> and I got this with the Tommy automatic at the thrift store for like five bucks. Deal with it. It fits nice. That. Okay, so there's those pieces. I um, like it. Also, this fits, fits is beautifully. The nail biter. Yeah. And it doesn't nice. look the best, but it fits nice. Yeah, sometimes comfort's a little better. Yeah. Sometimes it need to be tactical, but sometimes comfort's nice. Okay. Now, one of the best guns that we've picked up so far, the Evader, with See that video? Yeah. How much did we like this gun? Well, check out the second video and you'll find out how much we like this gun. Oh, yes. I already know I like this. Yeah, for a guy who no, eats bullets like mad. This doesn't work that well. But the thing about the Evader, which is no, nice, what else do you, want you get stock? to use your, uh, like, shorter socks that don't really fit you that fit that well uh, on different. your bigger guns so uh oh here. this is the evader the original sniper. scope scope there we go because this makes total sense because some days i need this when you can't aim that well but you're trying to snipe anyway you just <laughs> screw sniping <sighs> hopefully in the future we will see these drums as a uh, generic model item. And as a solo cow. item. Because these never show. You can only buy them on Amazon for way over price. Yeah, that or we can buy them as an individual piece. Because if Nerf were to sell those, how much do you think you'd pay for one of those new? Minus with the darts or minus the darts? Uh, I think you'd have to buy them with the darts, really. Uh... I mean, I think that's how they'd have to sell them. I think about eighteen to twenty dollars. Okay, I was thinking between that's fifteen expert. and twenty. So that's opinion on it. Expert. Can I see? <laughs> my, my not expert opinion on it. No, yeah, I think my expertise to the point of being opinion novice. on it. There she is. I want to see the uh, Vader barrel. Okay. So do I. I can hardly find it at all. It's clear. <laughs> I don't think this is really going to work with this gun. Yeah, I don't think it either. Yeah, bummer on that. Just keep it in your pocket and then like... Yeah, just stabby stabby. That doesn't look like, right. Just... Yeah, I didn't think it would, but that's why I pulled it out. Uh, here's the shield, which actually I think does look pretty cool. Yeah. Now, a lot of people hate the shield, but it's... But I have fought it in a close have, quarters... Yeah battle, but like if you have full cover and can sneak under a couch, you're pretty much invincible because you can like just peek out a tiny bit. I was going to say, that shield keeps me from getting popped in the face all the time when I use yes. it. Uh, I do prefer it on the side rail though as compared to the top. Yeah. Here, you want to take the... Uh, That's my piece? favorite stock possibly. I bought the shield actually. I didn't buy the shield personally, but I didn't... We got the shield with this. Yeah. That's not as good a fit as other things I've seen. It looks it a little fit. long. I think for a taller person it fits, but I think if you're yeah. under like 5'6", this is not your best combination, because I think it's going to tax like, your arm length. You'll be out like this, and it'll be eh, eh, and like too, too extended, and it'll make yeah. your aim wonky. But, but that's been I a lot of fun. I say, what do you suggest on this gun? Buy it? Yeah. I I like how I was gonna say you, if know, you have forty bucks. You might say it's pricey. It's one of those things that there's nothing wrong with it. Well, have you seen me. some of the new line of nerf? Yeah. A lot of it's pricey. Like there's nothing At least you're getting a very remarkable uh series I feel of like parts it's and the drum. People think that it's overpriced because of it used to be twenty dollars or so. But you don't have to really put in inflation. Well, not even inflation. In stock, that drum. And drum. 
and the barrel attachment. Yeah, it's got and the paint job and the Acu Strike darts, which I bet are harder to get out of mold. You were saying that this is possibly one of the best stocks that's made. This design of ridges yeah. and so forth. Now that I've actually gotten a good look at one of these, because I haven't really played with one of these before. Yeah. I really am pretty impressed with this stock, which yeah. I'm thinking, I don't think I'd be that excited about a stock. Yeah. I mean, aside from this one, which has a gun attached, because, I mean, it can't be that... <laughs> like, yeah. I'm out of bullets, eh, sort of. You know, I love that, but... That's like honestly. when you're the jerk... Like, when the <gasps> commander sneaks up to you, you, like, hold up your gun, and you pull it off, pull a click one on him. Like, whoop. Yeah, I mean, that's just perfect. Looks you like know, an M16 it's one of those way. things. Yeah, if you're one of the modders who really likes rebuilding these things, this one looks like it's it got... especially. Yeah, the, the um, decorative mods. This is a brilliant piece to play with, too. Yeah, um, honestly... You know, some things are expensive, but not overpriced. I think this is one of those things. Yeah, you're getting what you paid for between what feels like a good quality gun, and also great attachments, and just the clip. I mean, I feel like like we we're saying, ten, darts. ten bucks would be an awesome price on that clip. I think if you had it loaded. Yeah, but like Acu Strike darts or. Er, Versus elite darts, you can actually use Accu Strike darts now, and get good things out of them. Mm -hmm. But like elite darts, there's just so many better options. So having 25 Accu Strike darts is a nice bonus. Yeah, I mean they just, just wow. There's nothing wrong with this. Well, all things considered, we should probably uh, wind this up because I can't think of anything else to say for one thing. You? Uh, I know it's just it. kind of the per perfect nerf gun for a springer. Could be, could be. Is it worth getting a second one? Mm, I'll have to think about that. Yeah, because that's the event. If it wasn't for um, flywheels, I'm sure I definitely would. I was gonna say, there is the big question because I mean, there's a lot of the little ones you get extras of, like triads. Jolts. Nail biter kind of area. Do you think the nail biter would be a good well I mean we're talking about getting a second one, but that's a fifteen dollar gun, isn't 18. it? Eighteen. Eighteen? Although like Some people under forty ish, you know? And if you're really a nerf enthusiast like we are, I think the nail biter is a good one to get as a second for sure. Yeah, nerf. I'm lover. just not sure if most people would I think most people get the extra jolt. The yeah. extra triad. Uh, like, I think I might consider one, uh, I definitely, I'm thinking about it. If I see a If we a can modulator, afford it, maybe. The modulator? Yeah. Hmm. Like, it's not hmm. that I wouldn't... If I had 40 bucks in my hands right now, I might get it. I just don't normally have that much. Yeah, sitting around waiting for Nerf. Yeah. And of course, when there's other Fortnite things we want to get, not in game, by the way. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot. I think we out. ought to do more of your Fortnite videos too yeah. for your fans because Heck, leave a comment you gotta if see. you watch if you want to if you even play Fortnite and, as a nerfer, or if you want to see, and or if you want to see more Fortnite. Yeah, let us know what you want to see. Um, but yeah, I think we have to do a goals video for your Fortnite yeah. soon. But. That's probably something you'll see, and it'll be labeled accordingly. Yeah. Sound cool? Yeah. All right. Thanks for watching, guys, and hails to the Dragon Isle. Hails, and see you next time.